Rebecca, where are you? I'm not gonna say, so yeah. I... Let's press start there. Look at it. Evil Zero. Alright. Now, I can do this really quickly. I know exactly what to do. We just did it. So my guess is that we'll be right back to where we were in less than 10 minutes. Because all you need to do is wrap yourself around all these different back and forth locations. I'll go alone. Okay. You stay there, I'm gonna just run on ahead, do the Billy stuff. Billy does Billy things, cause Billy, 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 Billy. I'm going to go through here. And yeah, this is right after the train section, but if you know what you're doing, and since I'm just gonna kind of rush this to do it here, there's a green herb. Take that. There is some gas. And that's all you need from over here. And out. Ignore the leech man. Check the clock over here for no apparent reason. Equip the Molotov cocktails, which we made earlier. Check over here. Now, you don't actually need to go over here right now. I'm just doing it so I can get some stuff out of the way a bit early. Like that's why that's what I've been doing a lot of, is getting stuff out of the way early so later is a bit easier. Actually, I think I should shoot him once before I do it like this. That might be good. Now Molotov cocktail time. Really? Hopefully this works. Now let's waste six bullets on it. I'm doing worse already. You know what? Let me do one thing because I messed up there. Ah, uh, whack me dead, leech man. I'm gonna let myself get killed one time because I'd rather not waste health right now because health is a thing that's very valuable. And I know how to kill this guy without taking any hits. I just missed the first cocktail because I was too far away. Take me in your arms, you beautiful leech man. That was definitely something. All right. Still got things to check. Cutscene start. Low. Resident Evil Zero. Saving health one step at a time. From there. Continue. No, restart the game. I'd rather delete my save file. Thank you for asking. Squishy noises, because leeches are apparently squishy. Ever poked a leech? If your answer to that question is in fact yes, I'll then I'm alone. questioning Roger. why you were poking a leech. Okay. Go through here. Hmm. So, basically, there's no reason to go in this hallway yet, it's just... The reason, there's a reason later in the game, and if you don't take care of the leech now, you have to take care of them later. You can leave this one in the restroom, because, you know, he just doesn't leave this restroom, he just stays in here. And the only thing this restroom has is this green herb and this gas can. So if you take out the items, there's no reason to return here. I mean, it's a nice-looking restroom. I mean, nice-looking as in, it does a good job at looking pretty terrifying. Wait, did I not drop my... Billy, what are you doing? Am I really doing this to myself? <sighs> I forgot to drop the ink ribbons. That's almost comical. Alright, reset. Just because that would again waste. <laughs> now, equip these Molotov cocktails because no one can foresee what's coming because we haven't seen it like twice already. Oh my! Hey! I set myself on fire too, but it was worth it. 
Uh, no! Leech! Okay, no, I'll take a little bit of damage just for your sake. We get you to feel a little bit more important in life. No, throw it! Fantastic. You guys gotta look at a better look at what it does. If you don't kill the leechman without a Molotov cocktail, they'll actually spawn a lot more leeches all through this hallway. Did I just intercept an alien transmission? Okay, now let's drop off the gas cans here. And Rebecca, our favorite chicken lady. Let's get her to not follow us because there's one more thing we need to do. You just stay there. I need to go check up on this room right up here. See, so just gonna take a nice stroll. Bit of legs working out. Apparently, that's all he can do in prison because he killed 23 people. 23. A magical note we've read before. So blah 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 blah. Yep, 8:15. You don't say. It was in green, so you know it's important. Nothing else in here, though, so let's uh, take this glowing item. Crank handle a go go. That's obviously fine. Suddenly, birds break through the. S oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Billy's taking more damage this time, but that's okay. Billy's a strong guy, he can take it. Now, with that obtained, there's only like two more things for us to do. Hey, Rebecca, join up with me. Actually, you know what, Rebecca? Let's do this a little bit backwards than we did last time, just for the fun of it. Let's regroup. Okay. All right, now, Rebecca, there's something which I need you to do. Rebecca, I need you to go combine these two herbal items right here. There's a green herb, and over here should be a red herb. Now, you can combine these. Ta-da, you're a magician. Now, we're actually going to go this route first, just so we can get it out of the way. While we're all together. <gasps> Billy, what the fuck are you doing?! No, seriously, Billy, what the fuck? <laughs> Do you not have your gun equipped? Is that what's going on? That's it. Alright, well that was fun. Mm-hmm. We're making more mistakes this time, but you gotta live with the mistakes to appreciate the good things in life, right? Mistakes are a natural part of life, and if you don't make them, then... Hanging ammo, good. Billy just decided today was feeding time. He decided he felt sorry for all the zombies and just wanted them to nod a little bit on his arm, because, you know, I gotta give off as a form of charity in Billy's eyes. Good-willed, but ultimately stupid. The sink's faucet is rusty, not even a single drop of water comes out. Now, it should be two zombies followed by three zombies, and next, actually, there's four zombies in the room after this. That's why we're doing it now. Open the sesame. I didn't even touch the door, it just opened by itself there. You didn't do too bad there, Billy. I'll give him credit there. Stay back, Billy. We got at least one other zombie coming. Actually, I think there's two other zombies coming, if I'm correct. Is the third zombie really not aggravated yet? 
Is there even a third zombie? It was all my imagination. Really? I swear there was a third zombie. Whatever. What do I know? I'm just kind of. You, you pick up the shotgun, Rebecca. Take the shotgun. That's good. Billy can pick up the gas canisters. He already has a collection for me. What was that sound? Seriously, there was a sound plane right there, and I have no idea what it was. Oh, can't carry it right now. Billy, what do you have in your pockets? You don't need these. <laughs> Let's see, combine that with that. Uh, right, he's still got the crank handle. Alright, Rebecca. Sorry to call on you again, because I know you've got so much to do, but let's pick up this. That's a stack of chairs and other furniture. Put those in your pockets, in your pants. will be fine there. Doesn't seem to be anything special about it. Looking at this, Rebecca. Good, Satan. Take him in your pockets and cherish him all. No, just kidding. You also need to get the white statue and the black statue. Climb up the ladder. Cool, cool. Now Rebecca's got you Rebecca things. I should probably reload my gun before my character does the reanimation I was thinking. Well, we've done it. Killed zombies. Congratulations, us. There's a small army of herbal items, but currently our pockets are full, so no herbal items for us at the moment. But they'll be there for if we want to pick them up again, which we probably do want to count the both of us are almost dead, so, you know, it's probably a smart idea. And already we're almost back to where we were. All we need to do is take the lift and get back there. Then we'll be set. Now there's two things for us to take care of in here. Firstly, in here, there's a note for us to look at. Notes. It talks about the three rules of Umbrella, which is discipline, obedience, unity. That's also the rules for a hive mind, I might point out. Uh, let's get out of here. can't stop stopping Resident Evil because reasons. Now uh, we don't need the statue so leave that there. Alright, we also need a shotgun for now so examine it. Mmm, shotgun. Now leave it. Now we switch over to Billy. Billy, we don't need all these gas canisters. We really don't. Uh, let's see, anything else? Uh, you let me switch back off. No, we look like we're good here. Back out, where we go? Now back to do some checking out in the library. Should be this direction. Wait, there's a few more zombies, right. Always more zombies to appreciate. I should make sure that both of us are loaded on ammo before I take care of this next hallway. Combine there, Rebecca is good on ammo too. Good, good. I do this all day. That should have been a headshot. If this was remake, that'd be a headshot. That's two zombies for dead. Through the library. <laughs> now there's only a couple a few things in here that are kind of useful. We have this, but honestly, we don't need to pick it up right now. I know what it's for, and I was kind of just wasting space earlier because we don't need it for a while anyways. There's a map. I didn't know you could look at your items on your map. That's kind of weird. 
Train facility over here. What was this? In curbs, I think. Right. That's definitely not going to be needed for a while either. Now, Rebecca, as much as I don't want to do this, you're the one who needs to go up here because apparently um, Billy is, you know, you're too weak to turn this. It's a wind control for a lift. Now, this obviously uses the thing that we picked up earlier. Not the green herb. Use. The lift looks usable, but you'll need someone to go on to it first. Now, just to demonstrate my point. I'll check it out. Roger. If you put Billy on the lift and then try and make Rebecca turn it, use the lift? Yes. It doesn't look like Rebecca can use it. They don't say why, but. Alright, Billy, go off, go there. And now, Rebecca, go over here and stand on top of it. Use the lift? Yes. Ta-da! No, 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 if this kills me, I'm gonna fucking scream. Okay, good, good, good. Now what's my health like, though? I can take at least one more hit. Alright, that's dead. Probably get killed the next thing, though. Be careful, be cautious, Ryan. Combine this with that. There's clock theme things here too. Look, a clock, but it's missing a minute hand. Oh joy. Get off, get off, seriously, get off. Really? That we're not almost dead yet? If this fucking kills me, I am going to still... I don't know why I'm risking it so much, because I'd rather not take the least amount of damage. Why does that not hurt us more? Well, we managed to avoid that somehow. I really don't know how that worked out. Take this... Risk into the bird cabin, because I'm an idiot. Where are the bird's caw? Where the crow caws? That was an old poem, actually. I have enough room to pick up two more herbs. Rush it, Rebecca. Take the green herb, and the shots will be a red herb here. Really? We are being surprisingly resilient to damage right now. Now here's the red herb. I'll get out of here so we don't take too much damage from these crows. I'm surprised at how resilient Rebecca's being to get into the danger zone, which would then make me use my herb. Now, obviously, there's a lot of things in here, but we really can't do anything in here except unlock the door. And then we're back exactly to where we were in the game. Ain't that exciting, folks? <laughs> Just gotta stroll on down. Cool. Now, Billy being Billy, I'm gonna make him come back here. He's just chilling over by the library place. Through here? Yeah, I think it's through here. And then there should be the zombie that suddenly pops up out of nowhere. I know no idea where he comes from. I honestly thought that was a shadow at first. But nope, it's a creeping zombie. Has at least one more hit before it's dead. And there, it was two more hits. Billy Ass only has three more bullets in his handgun because he is a strong man. He risks life because he can. Um, a correction: there is a third type of herb in this game. There are blue herbs in this game, but they won't appear for a while. 
I have no reason why blue would be a here or anything. I don't like to have any purpose. No. Come on. Okay. All right, so we're gonna do a little bit of item exchanging now. Rebecca, you're almost dead. Fucking use that. And then combine these. Combine this with your own gun for the moment, and then exchange the not examine. You wait for Billy to catch up. All right. Oh, no, not switch characters. Go here. Exchange this with you. You just take all of it, Billy. Take all of it. There we go. We've combined. We're almost out of ammo, but we're gonna make it. We're gonna survive. We will survive. But seriously, though, we're almost out of ammo. This is probably not a good thing. But hey, you know, taking the struggles as they come. That's the Resident Evil way. Right? I think. Now please kill everything with me, because it's gonna be difficult. We're done with that. But he's on caution. I have three bullets left. He has seven bullets left. This is gonna be a pickle. But hey, there's stuff here, like here. Your local grenade launcher. Never know when that might come in handy. The grandfather clock appears to be broken. It stopped ticking altogether. There's a few things here, like there's a statue here of some mysterious cloaked man we don't know. This room is filled with art objects. It must be an art storehouse. That'd be a pretty educated guess. Some shotgun shells here. Billy, I hear you like shotgun shells. Why don't you pick this up? Take the shotgun ammo. Cool. Back with Rebecca. The pain depicts an, art, or an aristocrat lady. The painter has uh, accented or accentuated her sense of nobility. You really want her to feel noble, right? This pain here too, though, to look at. You look at the painting, or we're just gonna ignore it. We're going to ignore it. Where are you? Ah, the white statue. All right, we got it. Also, a new type of door here. It's locked. The door is embossed with a water motif, which means we have a fire motif door and a water motif. These paintings aren't even packed in boxes. They're just stacked here haphazardly. I wouldn't have noticed that without you mentioning it, Rebecca. Of course. Alright! Making some progress. Now... For the now, speaking of which, let's uh, head back to the main hall. Do a little bit of item sorting and saving and such. So Billy, I'm gonna make some important decisions and calls right now. Come over here, it's for discussion purposes. First of all, you're on caution. Which I think is fine for the moment. But uh, first of all, I should probably just leave this here. Oh yeah, you yeah, have all in your pockets. This stuff? Alright. Make some careful decisions. We are very low on ammo right now and everything. Alright, Billy, pick up the shotgun. You have some shotgun shells with it, so that should be good. There's some shotgun shells... Where were they in the facility? There was something... There's also some herbs back where we came from if we need some healing. In fact, Billy, just use this for now. I might regret ma making that call later. Uh, drop this, leave it here. Uh, we're going to do some exchanging. Exchange this for that. But we're also going to exchange your pistol for herb. There's no reason I'm making these calls right now, by the way. Absolutely no reason whatsoever. I'll also, for now, equip the shotgun. Take a risk. 
Yeah, we probably have enough room here to take a risk, so yeah. I... However, though, I'll before we... Out. Roger. No, no, Let's regroup. Okay. I am taking a risk with this one. And forward charge, march, wherever you want it to be. So let's uh, enter. Hi, Rebecca. Let's catch up, please. To this not conspicuously large room. And check out the thing only Blake had moved before. It's a machine for winding the chain. Start the machine? Yes. He's got to keep that held, though, so Rebecca needs to go off and do something. Alright, let's go collect the item that was obviously right into the cage thing. Let's go pick up the item. Take the facility key. It's for the fire motif doors. Should be fun. Who saw this coming? Now, Rebecca is going to be being eaten for a little bit. So, a giant centipede! Turns out he doesn't like being shot that much. Let's go, centipede beast. The beast of my dreams. Stupid, sexy giant centipede. Ow. Those has got the rough and tough for this. Let's go! As the centipede continues doing his thing. Ah, uh, kill the centipede in time. Stupid a thousand crawling legs. Even that pavilion caution for a little bit. Catch up with me, centipede. I should probably heal with that. Alright. Do our best when it comes back around, because then he has a really scripted pattern. Oh, what? You dropped her. You dropped her in the picker boat. I didn't even know he could do that. That shows what I know. Oh. I'm out of ammo. You don't say. Rebecca! Are you alright? Yes, thank you. Romantic. I mean, there's not very many things more romantic than killing a giant centipede to save somebody. I think. Maybe my opinion on what romance is isn't exactly correct to most people, I'm not sure. Um, still though, giant centipede's dead. So that's cool. Let's get on out of here. Mm-hmm. blunt trauma from the grenade launcher killed it. <laughs> Apparently so. I think I, I think maybe it would have died even if I didn't shoot a grenade at it, because it seemed to die the moment before I lost my grenade. So I probably just wasted one, but whatever. It happens. I have a lighter? The lighter appears to be out of fuel. It's useless right now. Good to know. Does Rebecca have something? What does Rebecca have right there? Ah, uh, medical set. A set of tools used to mix and prepare medicines. Or so she claims. No other Resident Evil character needs that shit to f Anyways, though. We're actually Rebecca right now. Not I'm not sure why, but we are. However, though, we also have a fire motif key. There's at least two doors in this facility I can think of right now that we can open with that. However, now would probably be the wisest of all times to save our game. 
you know, after boss encounters and all that, typically it's not a bad idea to think about saving your game. So let's run around through here. Take the ink ribbon. Let me first do some exchanging here, though. I don't need two handguns, it turns out. So exchange this for your shotgun, and let's leave this shotgun behind, because we don't need it right now. Speaking of which, Billy, even though I know you like that thing, you should probably leave that grenade launcher for now for later. Cool. No, 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 not... No, I will pick up the shotgun just so I can move it to a place where I'm not going to pick it up every single time I go through here. Right here should be good. Fantastic hoop. Now, of course, the second question out up on top of that one. Let's save our game. Actually, let's first make sure that both of our guns are equipped. So I don't forget next time I play. And take a moment to save the game. There's a typewriter. Core data? Yes. I'll make a slot here to save. Cool. And now, DOS make my life easier. Drop the ribbons here. Leave. Now, where are there some items I can pick up for my own benefits? We can start with the fire motif door over here. I'll go check over there. Okay. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Just the same response to both of those things. Okay, so there's a fire motif door in here, which we're gonna use first. Of course, at least two zombies. Not ammo, Billy. You got four shots. You have to make these four shots count. Ow! 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 That fuck! I meant to avoid the zombie. There's one zombie we can't kill right now with our current ammunition. So. Split up. Okay. Stay there, Rebecca. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get help. I find first love's kiss twice. Great. Through here? Through here. Wait, Rebecca has the duck. <laughs> Well, that's fun. Good luck, Rebecca. Remember, Rebecca, I need a book at the moment you come in the side of that room. There's a zombie right by the door. They saved the enemy's locations. I'm actually a bit impressed. Oh, never mind. He just moved inexplicably. Use the facility key. This is bad though, we have no ammo except for the grenade launcher. I'm not wasting grenade launcher ammo on regular zombies. What's through here? Hopefully I'll find some ammo in here. Hey, that's a little nice windowsill. You know you could make your escape, never mind. Then here we find an empty glass bottle, be nice with those uh, canister stuff we picked up earlier. What's this? Ah, lighter fluid. That's another nice thing to have. What is that, like meat, eggs? Can't quite tell from this angle. Can I take a look at it from here? Nope. Is that something in the corner or is that just my imagination? It's just my imagination. A wide selection of spices and seasonings. Some of them are quite rare nowadays. That's interesting. The sink has since lost its shine. These utensils appear to be well used. Well, that's what this was for. Lighter fluid. Where did you guys honestly expect you could find lighter fluid in the fucking kitchen? It's a refrigerator, the door is broken, refuses to open, sure thing. Well, with gained lighter fluid, let's head on out. There's at least one of the door that requires the fire motif key. Run through here, avoid the zombie. This way. 
come with me. Okay. All right, come. Uh, actually, Billy, how are you doing on item holding? You have nothing. All right, Billy, you know what? If you're gonna be like that, you might as well just pick up this shotgun because there's some ammo with it. Just in case we absolutely need to use it. Take the shotgun. It might be for the best, actually, if you carry that around with us for the moment. Actually, there's some shotgun shells right over there, aren't there? And there's even some more upstairs. Let me go pick this up. Gas tank, sure. Combine this with that. But then leave this here and leave this here. Now, Billy, you being a big boy, I'm going to trust you with these shotgun shells. Please try your ba uh, best to use them wisely. Of course, we're gonna reload these immediately, but you know, whatever. There's actually a second thing of shotgun shells which I want you to pick up on our way going to the next main area. Alright, there's actually two stops that we're gonna take. I almost went back downstairs. How oh, tank controls. Now you might say, but Ryan, don't we have both a statue of an angel and a statue of a devil? Couldn't we balance the scales? The answer to that is no, for a very simple fact that uh, one of them has a ween and the other one doesn't have a ween. And that makes a difference because it's a weight puzzle, so we need to find weens. Have to give those angels their weens, and no Red Bull is not an option. Let's go look over here. Here we go. Take the shotgun ammo. Now we have some firepower. However though, to make ourselves feel a little bit more secure with healing items, I'm going to let Rebecca now... Not, uh, sorry Rebecca. I need Rebecca to pick up the two herbs that were back here. We didn't pick them up earlier, so might as well do it right now. 